Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Beef Reacts. Today, today we're checking out something I probably should have checked out a while ago, but you know, I've been I've been binging One Piece, the uh, animated show with uh, with Ryan, our lovely, lovely editor, who uh, is awesome. But because he's never seen it, so I've been binging it with him, and. I would say we'd react to it, but the problem with us reacting to a thousand plus episode series is that um, it's a thousand plus episodes, and these normally twenty minute episodes become about forty. So instead of being able to binge it and get up to a spot where I'd like us to be, it's like it, it's not worth. But Netflix is having a live action trailer. And the live action trailer do be looking kind of spicy. What the hell is that light refraction? Sorry, I was looking up. I have, I'm stupid. But, um, yeah, One Piece has been a show that I watched on Toonami, like right after Naruto or before Naruto, and then Prince of Tennis, and then March and Awakens Romance, or Mare, and then Zatch Bell. I forget what the actual lineup was, but it was fun. I enjoyed it thoroughly. And Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu-Gi-Oh was fucking hype to watch. No kizzy. But the main thing here is, uh, you know, like personality downloads for like little boys. I feel like I feel like Monkey D. Luffy was a big one for me. And like, I remember I wanted to be a pirate. I remember I wanted to be the best. Like, it, it's a show that really is near and dear to my heart and been a part of my life for such a long time. And getting to like see a live action version of it, I think would be really cool as long as it's done well. And I've really not seen anything for this. I heard it was announced and I was, I thought it was a meme and then I saw stuff from it and I went, this has to be a meme. And then it looked good and then looked bad at the same time. And I really have no idea what the seasons are covering because there's no fucking way this thousand plus episode arc thing, you're going to be able to get in a live action fashion. And I can't imagine this is going to be amazing, but technically Oda is going to be a part of it. So it's, it's really going to be here. That I, I, it's going to be a fucking crapshoot for me. Oh, yeah. We should just jump into it. The costumes well, look good. Fame. Power. I found everything this world has to offer. Free yourselves. Take to the seas. Okay. So, like, yes. I'm not just saying yes, you know, like, uh, like, oh, that's awesome. Like, all the costumes look on point, and the set design is beautiful. I feel like Goldie Roger could have given that one a little bit more. Wealth, power, I've had it all. Like, homie, you're, you're inspiring the fucking age of pirates right now. Like, that's not how Goldie Roger did it. He w he died with a fucking smile on his face. My treasure is yours to find. <laughs> there we go. So what do you say? That's what I like. Are you with me? Obviously not. Mutiny. <laughs> Why would anyone want to be a pirate? This is the best thing there is. Wind in your back. Salty sea air. A loyal crew by your side. It's ready! What is it? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of awesome. Oh, don't do this. Dolly Roger, we are the Straw Hat crew. No. Not a fan of that. I shouldn't say I'm not a fan of that. It's just like Luffy doesn't call. They're making like he's goofy and he's funny, but they're making him too self-aware in a way. And like I'm not saying to like shit on it. I'm saying it more like they're making him too self-aware in the sense of like Monkey D. Luffy isn't like he doesn't call them the Straw Hat Pirates. He doesn't say that about them. They don't get that name until they really enter the Grand Line. Like, he's referred to as Straw Hat, but he doesn't really give his crew a name. He's just Monkey D. Luffy and the Luffy. Like, that's not what they're called. Smoker's technically the one to give them the name. I just, okay, it is what it is. I, it's like, it's like, 
Well, Beef, you're getting upset about these technicalities. I'm not trying to get upset about the technicalities. I'm saying that the technicalities fucking exist, okay? Fuck me, okay? Jesus. I feel like We're heading up to the Grand Line. A treacherous stretch of ocean with bigger islands, bigger pirates. And that's where we're gonna find the One Piece. Yeah. She's been making enemies everywhere we go. Okay, yeah, again, set design for this show looks fucking phenomenal. I I will say I wish they added more vibrancy to the colors. I feel like everything feels a little muted. And, like, that's not to, like, again, it's not to shit on it. It's more of just, like, it just feels a little muted in the way that it's handling the situation. Like, I would like to see a little bit more vibrant blue. Like, One Piece is such a vibrant world where the colors are so exciting and, like, awesome to see. And seeing a live-action version of it, like, I like that they're keeping the, the the zaniness, the wackiness, the fucking dopeness of it. But that vibrancy is something that I also would like to see. It's a death! Luffy, they are hunting you! Guy, yeah, save your ass. Well, I saved your ass. You'll have to excuse them. They're idiots. Yes, we are. Uh, this group. I'm gonna. I'm. I'm gonna have to react to this. But again, is this a movie? Is this a show? Like every. This show cannot possibly do all of the fucking East Blue, in a real like in a relatively short amount of time. There is. No fucking shot of that happening. And if it does, it'll feel rushed. I'm gonna be like, cause what if we don't get the walk? If we don't get the walk at Arlong Park, I'll be pretty fucking pissed. Where's gonna be my four episodes of backstory? Where's gonna be my dog shit pacing? I I, I love One Piece so much, but I will shit on it. Our crew can handle anything. I'll do you the kindness of killing you all together. Loser. You're my captain from now until the end. I'm gonna kick your ass because no one misses with my friends. What's so special about you? I'm Monkey D. Loopy. Yeah. And I'm going to be king of the pirates. All right. I'm not going to cap. The opening credit did look awesome. Yeah, that looks fucking dope as shit. Okay. I'm just, I'm just going to say it just straight up. And I feel like it needs to be said. All, like, everyone at home, be sure to thank the production crew because the production crew of this show deserves in a, a fucking award for what it's done here like the casting it's good but the set design the costuming the fucking makeup every it, it it's it's perfect i shouldn't say it's perfect but it's 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 damn good it's damn fucking good i didn't know there were so many pirates it's terrible Do we see i know right in? Bellamy. I Albedo. didn't know there was Foxy. They got fucking Foxy. Pirates. No, no, no. Are you willing? Are you a victim of piracy? Come to the 10th and A Street at 730 on Monday. Speak up. Speak up now. Now. So now. many pirates. It's terrible. And fuck you, Colby. You pussy. Bellamy. I know, ass. right? Where's my face? Amen. I don't think Luffy would act like that, but amen. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you don't mind, like, comment, share, subscribe. Uh, question of the day is, what live-action anime would you really want to see? I think mine is either a Toradora live-action, because I just love, I would just like to see more Toradora, to be completely real with you. Rosario Vampire, not in the sense of the uh, horny-ass TV show, but the manga-accurate Rosario Vampire would be pretty cool to see. A...
Ooh, ooh, Dead Man Wonderland live action would probably be my go-to pick. I think that'd be awesome. But let me know what your thoughts are. Comments down below. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, you have to be able to fill out the form. To fill out the form, what you got to do is you got to hit that subscribe button. It really helps everyone out. It's free to do. It's a good time. It'll make you get bitches. Or if you don't want bitches, you might get friends because a friend in me is a song from Toy Story and a parasocial relationship is something that we're all destined for. But I post every day. I react to something new every day. I make skits. I have a vibe. I shouldn't say I have a vibe, but I like to vibe from time to time. So I think what you should do is have a great rest of your day. I already told you what you got to do. Peace out. I will catch all of you tomorrow.